Hi everyone, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota Scion. My name is Chris and today we'll take a look at this 2010 Jeep Liberty. This is a pre-owned vehicle we have here at Sherwood Park Toyota. It's an absolutely gorgeous Jeep and it's the limited model so it's loaded with all sorts of great stuff on it. Being a Jeep of course you do have four wheel drive and under the hood you get the 3.7 liter V6 engine. It gives you about 210 horsepower. This Liberty does have a trailer hitch and trailer brake on it so you're all ready to go with towing if you need to. You can tow up to 5,000 pounds with this Liberty which is awesome. You've got your daytime running lights on the front. You have a beautiful chrome waterfall grill. Everything looks really good. It's nice and clean. It's beautiful gray metallic color. And like I said, this is a limited edition, so it's got all sorts of great goodies and features on it that make it stand out and make it really comfortable. You'll be riding on 18-inch Dunlop mud and snow tires. And these are chrome alloy rims all the way around. You have four-wheel disc brakes all the way around. You have wheel locks on all four tires, and you also have nitrogen in all four tires. As you can see, they're in great condition. It's only a two-year-old vehicle, so it's got lots of life left in it. Looks really good. Those chrome alloy wheels look awesome. Six-spoke wheel. I guess that's seven. Don't know how to count. Anyways, if you want to follow me, we'll jump on inside and check out the interior. To help you get inside your 2010 Jeep Liberty Limited, you have a factory key. It does have an integrated key fob with lock, unlock, as well as a panic button. You also have a button for your rear hatch glass, and it also has remote start direct from the factory. I tested the remote start about a minute ago, and it works beautifully. That's going to work really well on cold winter mornings because you'll never have to get into a cold vehicle. In fact, let's give it a shot right now. Hit that little button right there two times if the camera will focus, and it's going to start right up. There you go, very nice. So on a cold winter morning, you're never gonna have to get into a cold vehicle. It is locked now, so just hit the unlock button. And it'll open right up for you. Let's take a look at all your power options. On the door here, you have your door locks, power windows, and power mirror controls. Uh, you have a beautiful chrome door handle, looks really nice. Driver windows automatic down, automatic up, which is very nice. You've got leather throughout this Jeep Liberty. You can see you've got leather on the armrest here. You can see the stitching there. Nice big pocket on the door, nice big speaker, crank your music up. Cloth floor mats throughout this Jeep, direct from the factory. They fit well, they look great. You do have a power driver's seat. Goes forward, back, up and down with manual recline. It is a memory seat, so you have two person memory. You can set it to whatever you need. Beautiful Jeep logo there. You can see it's leather, it's also heated. Got beautiful stitching on it with the white contrast, looks really sharp. There's your uh, memory seat, two person. You can set that however you want. I have to say the seats in this Jeep are so comfortable. They've got a lot of um, bolstering in the back and on the bottom, so you're gonna stay in place and they're very, very comfy. You can already see that this Jeep has 62,490 miles on it. We'll start it up one more time for you. Just to show you that all the warning lights do go off except the red one which just tells me I need my seatbelt on and that green one just means I have my uh, lights on right now. Uh, compass northeast, 15 degrees in our showroom this morning. Everything looks really good. I'm going to shut it off just so that I don't fill the showroom with all sorts of nasty fumes. Wouldn't want that. Uh, you do have a leather wrapped steering wheel with some controls here. This just takes you through all your information up in your speedometer, your fuel mileage, your trips, all that kind of stuff. Same with this one on the other side here. It takes you through and changes it from your compass to distance to empty, things like that. And there's your cruise control tucked nicely in behind. Like I said, you do have a trailer brake already installed as well as a trailer hitch on the back. This Liberty can tow up to 5,000 pounds. So if you need to take a little trailer with you or something, you can definitely do that. You have a beautiful center audio system here. So you can see on this side, there's your navigation. We're at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park. So when you buy this Liberty, it'll direct you all the way home from here. You have radio, AM, FM, as well as satellite. Satellite's not hooked up, but as you can see, all you have to do is call them to subscribe to Sirius Satellite Radio, and you'll have that. It does have presets, does have everything that you're gonna need. Touch screen, very nice, very fancy. Got your clock in there, all the good stuff. Does have auxiliary, as well as Bluetooth, and, uh, Pretty much everything that you need right there. Here's your climate control down below. There's your fan speed, there's your temperature, there are your different zones. It is automatic, so you can set it to auto, and it's going to just keep the temperature at whatever you set it at. It does, of course, have air conditioning, defrost, all that good stuff right there. Chrome accenting around it looks really sharp. Down below, there is your dual stage uh, heated seat. The vehicle's not on, that's why it won't light up. There we go. Uh, traction control, downhill uh, cruise control, so if you're going downhill, the uh, 
Liberty will jump down a gear to help keep you from speeding up too much. There's your hazard lights. And then a power outlet and your passenger's heated seat. Tow haul mode in the Liberty. There's the button right there and your automatic transmission with low gear selection. You can go all the way down to first gear. There's your four-wheel drive selection. So on a cold winter morning with lots of snow, you're never going to get stuck. Or if you want to take this Liberty off-road, you can do that. Beautiful, soft, leather-covered and leather-stitched uh, center armrest. You've got this top tier. You can then take this out. And you've got a nice big storage area down below there. Take whatever you need with you. It's not going to roll around. Beautiful bucket seat leather, heated for your passenger as well. Jeep logo in there, looks really good. Love the stitching. This Liberty is absolutely beautiful. It's the limited edition, got all sorts of goodies. Even this handle right here, look at There's leather stitching on the handle too, with chrome accents. Everywhere. Inside here, there is your glove box with information on your nitrogen filled tires, as well as your owner's manual. Everything looks really good. You have airbags up front for driver and passenger. You also have a power tilt and sliding sunroof up there. We had some rain last night, so there's a little bit of water on it right now. Uh, you do have an uh, integrated garage door opener as well. Another little storage area up here. You can throw some things up there. Everything looks really good. So if you want to follow me, we will jump in the back and I'll show you the rest of this awesome car. All right, moving to the back of the 2010 Jeep Liberty Limited now. Up to top, you can see you do have a roof rack. So if you ever need to throw anything up there, you've got that extra space. This is a five passenger SUV. You've got two up front. You've got three in the rear, so you've got lots of room. These rear windows roll all the way down, which is nice and convenient. Chrome door handles in the back as well, power windows of course. Nice big speaker down below there, very nice. Your leather seating continues in the back, you've got map pockets on the back of the seat, you've got some cup holders down there. Your carpet floor mats continue, it's a little dark because it's black, but everything looks really good. This is a 60-40 split rear seat. Headrests, you can fold it down, tuck it out of the way. You of course have child seat anchors, you have a rear defrost glass in the back. Nice and clean, smells really good, doesn't smell like it's been covered up with anything, it just smells legitimately good. Very, very nice. So let's shift around to the very back now. This is, uh, one nice thing about the Liberty is that you can open the back hatch and you can open the back glass. So down below there, there's your trailer hitch. It does have your power outlet, so like I said, 5,000 pounds, you got lots of towing capacity. Badging looks really nice, 4x4 Limited. Looks really good. Rear wiper. So you do have access to your rear glass with uh, the button on your remote. The one right there, just hit it two times and it's going to pop right open for you. Whoops, i get the camera to focus. That's better. That's very handy, so if you've got your hands full and you're coming up here, just hit that button. It'll pop that right open for you. So you can get into the rear that way. Or, close it up and open up the rear hatch fully. And voila. Nice and clean back here, you have a cargo cover. You can cover everything up so it's hidden out of the way. You, of course, have your spare tire underneath. Toolkit jack, you've got a nice little in-floor storage area here. You can tuck some stuff away in there as well. There's some badging to show you you have an Infinity audio system, if we can get the camera to focus. There we go. So you've got a fantastic sounding audio system. You can crank some music up, it's gonna sound awesome. Like I said, you've got your Sirius XM radio, you've got auxiliary input, so you can hook up whatever kind of music you like. Once again, your chrome alloy wheels on your Dunlop 18-inch mud and snow tires. Looks really good. Got some wheel opening moldings around. Lots of chrome everywhere. Looks really sharp. Beautiful gray color. So let's fold down the rear seat here super quick, just so you can see. There's a little uh, handle right down here. Give it a tug. That seat falls forward with no effort, so you can fold that side down, put them both down, one up, one down, whatever you need. People, cargo, cargo, people. Always going to work. Very nice. And of course, everything on the passenger side up front looks awesome as well. Power locks, power windows, storage pocket, chrome door handle, all that good stuff. This is absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Power passenger seat, which you don't find very often. Very nice. And heated, of course. So if you'd like some more information on this beautiful 2010 Jeep Liberty Limited, please give us a call here at Sherwood Park Toyota. You can reach us at one 419 8955 You can also find us at sptoyota.com, or better yet, come see us and come see the Liberty. Take it for a test drive. You're going to love it. We're at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.